Fact Work. TFNN. Headline News Update. Hi, folks. This is the uh, Tiger Financial News Network um, update. This is the one o'clock update. I've just finished my show, The Tiger Technician's Hour. I'm also the author of the opening call daily newsletter. So the Dow is down 200 points from its high. Today is down at 171, trading 27,732. This is the H pattern that we've been talking about, showing it on the noontime update every day. This is where you come straight down, make a little arch formation. And if you take out that left side low, that's not a good sign. But so far, it's holding very nicely in the Dow. The S&P, that's a little different. Look, the S&P has already come down. It is trading at this point down 35. Next, there it is. And it's 33.10. It's got to hold that. At the noon update, I said it mustn't break 33.28. was in the 33.40s. This is a big move down. It's options expiration, but that's not the issue. The issue is the pattern. Once the pattern forms, it doesn't matter why. And look at the cues. Took it right out. Much lower. It's down to 365.23. Below 265 is below the 266 support from about seven days ago. Not a good sign. Look at Apple. Apple has smashed through that left side low, trading down 340 at 106.94. Be careful. This is a market where you just have to be careful. And what's also very important is that if you're looking at the TLT, the TLT is holding it at 163s. <clears throat> if the market pulls back and money starts to go into the TLT, the bonds, you'll see the bonds push into the 164. 165 and then 166s. So this is just at least something to look at. Crude oil had a real nice gain. Um, it's giving back some of it, but it's still up 30 cents. So it's a, kind of a mixed market. And if you're looking at the grains, look, wheat. Look at that huge move in wheat. It's up eight. Look at the huge move in. That's why, um, oh, look at that move in soybeans up 12 and a half. Look at corn. Corn is also up. So the DBA, which is an ETF, that uh, we actually have for the opening call subscribers. This is trading in 1493. Um, that means that you're looking at other areas that are starting to work. That's a big difference to what we had seen before. <laughs> the dollar is not working. The dollar is kind of stuck. So we're looking at inflation, the Fed wanting inflation. It's going to get inflation if these other areas start to work. So uh, with that said, um, have a great weekend. Happy New Year to those Jewish people who are celebrating. And we'll see you on Monday. Stay tuned for Steve, Dave, and Tom O'Brien.